Now we're back to CapCut. Let me show you where you can find templates. You can go over to CapCut.com and find it there. It's going to be in the top menu, but I'm going to link to a specific page as well in the video description. This is the template page. You can search for specific search terms. Video image is available. You can also browse by category. Let us, for example, use business. And I'll pick just a random one. Let me use this one. Left click on it. And then a preview window opens. There are more similar templates to choose from, but when you've got what you want, just use this button and it's going to open the sign-in form. If you don't want to sign in, you can just close this and you can still use it without signing in. We just do it. The adjustment options, they depend on the template that you use. So in this case, we've got a lot of text and we've got five different images or video placeholders. So we could import five different media files. Let me just show you how this is done. And when you want to replace it, just go to media and here you can upload your files. Let me just use a video file right here, this one. I drag and drop it into this box. Confirm via replace. And it's now going to replace the first image placeholder in the template. It takes some time to get uploaded and processed. But here we are. So it's fairly easy to do. Very intuitive. And as I've said, in this case, we could have replaced five different media files. So you can jump to the next one, click on this little icon on it, and then replace this as well. On this side, you can use these templates. On the top right, you see export, blue button. So when you're done, you can export this. And it's free to use on TikTok. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.